Stage two is open for me now, so there's three goals in this. All my upgrades have come in, so I've got it probably about 80% upgraded, I reckon, by now. Uh, three goals. First one is I've fixed your handling a bit, oh, because it was rubbish yesterday, Thursday. Give it a test. You shouldn't go off track for more than five seconds. Da -da -da. Uh, so it's sorted out from yesterday. Well, my PR on this is 91.3, so it should be enough to finish the series it's in, the main series anyway. Uh, Andy did say it's, there's another free goal, so there's obviously been a couple of extra um, races put in, in another series for an extra free goal somewhere else, so thanks for that, Andy San. Uh, right, so I've got 21 out of 26 upgrades. I'm probably not going to upgrade it anymore now. Engine, 230. I don't want to obviously do anything else if I don't need to. I'm sure I won't need to do any more than this to win the car anyway. So I could quite easily spend another four, five hundred gold yet, easily. So I don't really want to do that actually, that engine one. One after that will probably be racing dollars I would imagine. Right, so we've got two laps around here. We've got to win, what we've got to do, I can't remember. Right, no more off track in five seconds. Don't say you've got to win, you? Sure you have. Right, two laps round Laguna Seca. What well, you got to win it with less than five seconds off track, so you could probably chop across the corner. That'd be all right, I would imagine. Not that like I'm going to do it intentionally, but now the upgrades I've got on here, this should be extremely easy because they must have geared this up for. Because everything's geared up for American time anyway. And I know people in America will be on this stage too. Most of them with still no upgrades. Cockpit view. The amount of upgrades I've got on here, this is should be just a procession. I know a lot of you can't afford the upgrades that I can. A lot depends really where you are in the game. If I was obviously um, didn't have anywhere near the revenue that I've got in the game balance, obviously wouldn't be able to upgrade it anywhere near as much, but the car's that fast that you're probably going to be fine anyway. So where he said he's fixed the handling, I wouldn't know if he actually has fixed the handling or not. Because of all the upgrades that have come in, the car's naturally going to get a lot, lot better anyway. Now I would imagine with, with um, the upgrades that I have got, I would imagine the opposition cars I've got are going to be faster than if you've got no upgrades because they definitely do factor that into it.
the opposition do seem to be quite aggressive very early on they don't want really to get aggressive till about stage four or five but this one it seems to be already on stage two I'm sure this car is going to be the fastest car we've got on the whole game, top speed wise anyway. It's definitely going to be featured in time trials and what have you. 